Meanwhile, tonight, Baltimore police are investigating claims of excessive force. Witnesses say officers used a taser on a woman holding a baby. Authorities refute the claim, and they say they have the crime camera video to back that up. 11 News I-10 reporter David Collins is live downtown at police headquarters with the details. David? Stan, the incident started as a drug arrest, and as you mentioned, a city crime camera captured all the action, but the tail of the tape may not be enough in this case. Kids playing football in the Gilmore Homes courtyard were almost struck by police cars rolling up, in their words, fast and furious onto the sidewalk. They got out, guns on their hands, spray sticks like. They arrested a drug suspect. This and other photos taken by a resident named September reveals the officer is grabbing the man's throat while cuffed. Police dispute claims they tased him. Witnesses allege the officer threw him to the ground and put a knee on his throat. Once they lift him up, finally, he starts slinging some more. Like, I can't breathe, I can't feel the side of my face, I can't feel my arms. So now he's breathing, where all you see white stuff coming out the side of his mouth. The commotion drew a crowd. The suspect's brother spotted his sibling's cell phone on the ground and picked it up. Police arrested him. Then a lady holding a 10 month old tried to intervene. According to witnesses, the baby's father is the one who picked up the phone. The police takes the taser just like this, they flat, flat, and hit him. Once they hit her, she moved back like this, the baby now tipping on her hands. Police say this all happened within the view of a city crime camera. Deputy Commissioner Jerry Rodriguez watched the video. I could tell you after watching the videotape that is not the case. That is not the case. Uh, that doesn't minimize the incident, but I'm just telling you that the lady was not holding a baby at the time. What happened with the baby? Somebody picked the baby up. Everybody got to screaming, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Police arrested four people. The deputy commissioner canvassed the area, seeking witness testimony, additional video, and to reassure residents that police are taking claims of aggressive force seriously. Not only do the, does the community live under challenges, the officers work under some challenges, and we often have to balance our ability to do police work, uh, but we never compromise on our goal to ensure that we do uh, constitutional, compassionate policing. Authorities do not plan to publicly release the crime camera footage. The department assigned several officers to investigate. Reporting live from the Bishop Robinson City Police Headquarters building downtown, David Collins, WBAL-TV 11 News.